construction of this thing is pretty straightforward. It's just a piece of scrap ply with a tsunami big boat bilge pump screwed to the underside of it, and then a pelican case that's just held on with a strap. The wires go through silicone into the hole inside the box, and then um, there is no switch or anything on the outside. The pump is activated by a magnetic window switch, just moved in place, held in with Velcro. So there's no switch to, to fail due to saltwater corrosion or anything like that. Just can't lose this little magnet because um, and obviously it wouldn't work. And inside the Pelican case, we just have a uh, model airplane lithium battery. Use any battery depending on, uh, if you don't have this set up for lithium, you could use a, a small um, sealed lead acid battery like an alarm battery. This is 5.8 amp hours. Um, I can put two of them in here, which will run this pump for well over two hours. I think the pump draws about three and a half amps. Um, so, you know, do the math. A 5 amp hour uh, small lead acid would probably do the trick at, at, at a significant weight penalty, but it's still fairly small. The magnetic um, window security switch can't handle the current, so it just goes through a standard car relay. You can get it from any AutoZone for a few bucks, um, and then just a fuse in line. Um, that's basically it. The bilge pump stows in the goat under the middle seat and doesn't take up much room. It's tied with a lanyard so it doesn't float away in case of a capsize. It can be also stowed vertically so then I have lots of room for cooler or whatever other gear.